Hey guys, welcome to Offshoot Comics Out Topic. We're your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. Also known as David Clark. And Walter Bryant. And today we're talking about a really cool rumor we found. In the next couple of years, there's going to be seven DC Comics movies coming out. Yeah, now, um, that would be like mainlining DC movies, basically. Uh, yeah, don't go ask your mom and dad with mainlining it. Just trust me. Okay, <laughs> so anyway, um, we, uh, we, uh... We've been watching Marvel movies as they've been rolling them out slowly but constantly for about the past, what, six, seven years? Mm -hmm. And they've been building their entire cinematic universe. Yeah, okay, so DC decided we're going to take a machine gun and just put them all out there all at the same time. Yeah, so it's like someone just woke up from like a seven-year nap and they're like, Oh, yeah, well, oh my God, no! <laughs> we are so behind! <laughs> <laughs> we are so behind. So they're, they're, they're trying to basically go through their own phase one. Um, in like two years. Yeah. Um, which they have the money to do. Um, but there's no movie coming out next year, which means that's two years now since the last DC movie. Yeah, and that's they're true. Just, they're letting Marvel still run rampant. And by the time they get their phase one out, Marvel's in phase three. Yeah, and their phase three is actually looking pretty cool. Yeah. But, I mean... Superman versus Batman. That's looking like it might be okay. I mean, there's going to be a lot of. I don't know cameos. how much versus there's going to be, and plus the cameos, the fact that they're not going to be like superhero cameos, but like their alter ego cameos. Well, they, well, we don't know that for sure. I mean, it could. Well, okay, look, we know that Cyborg isn't going to be Cyborg no, because they're going to have to have a Cyborg origin movie. So Which you're, you're not going to. You're, you're, you're not going to. But here's the thing, though. The correct thing to do would be to have them come into like cameo as heroes. Which makes us certain that Warner Brothers will pick the exact opposite route and have them come in as just Diana instead of. Well, no, Wonder Diana's going to be Wonder Woman. I mean, they, she has a Wonder Woman costume and everything. So, in so, movie, so, so, so that that, which is, means, that is confirmed. Which means she'll she'll at the end of the movie she'll land down to them and say, "Hey guys," and then that'll be it. No, she actually is filming the first film. Of the no, no, first no, no. So no, no, I guarantee you. They'll, they'll cut it out. out. Yeah. Because Warner Brothers will make the exact wrong choice here. Yeah, she'll put on her uniform at the like end of the movie and go, we need to talk. And then that'll be the yeah, end of the movie. It. That'll be it. Because uh, yeah. I have zero faith in you, Warner Brothers. <laughs> zero faith. <laughs> I have um, lots of faith in you. I have no faith. But you, you, you made Ryan Reynolds Green Lantern. That's a problem for me. It's, mm, it's not that made him Guy Gardner. It would have worked. Guy Gardner. Yeah, but you don't give Guy Gardner a movie. You give Guy Gardner a cameo. Warner Brothers would do it. Oh, God. Please they not. made Superman Returns. That movie Zero does not faith. exist. It does not exist. Zero that movie faith. does not exist. They made a movie in, in where Bane was killed with a regular gunshot by Catwoman. Before that, they made a movie where Bane was a plant. Zero faith. <laughs> I, I, I mean, if I if I could, if I could have less than no faith in you, I would do that. Please understand, Batman and Robin was so terrible that people have actually forgotten it existed. Like like George Clooney, when people talk about what George Clooney's done, they never bring this movie up. That's true. They don't. They like they never like, bring it up. They're, they're always talking about how great an actor he is. And like for I'll as I say let's, let's just say he was the worst Batman. I yeah, every that. now and then. But like we pan Ben Affleck all the time for Daredevil. Like he, he's you know like he comes up but no one gives George Clooney flack about Batman because everyone has just decided it doesn't exist. Everyone and people like George Clooney. People like Ben Affleck. I don't, I don't know. Really? Yeah, Matt Damon likes him. Huh. I like Matt Damon. I think he's a pretty cool actor. He he he'd be a better a better Batman. Nah, he looks too old. Is, is it, wait, Matt Matt Damon. He's the one who plays in uh, the the Bourne movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He'd be a good Batman because he'd actually be able to do it. And if they're going for an older Batman, then pick the guy who looks older. Fair enough. I, yeah, I, I can't actually. Ben Affleck argue that did Daredevil. <laughs> that's, yeah, that, that, that is, is my our, entire argument against him. That that's pretty much everyone's problem with with, with him. Is he, he was Daredevil? That and he was ashamed of the fact that he was Daredevil. Now, now to be fair, he that was a be. good movie to be ashamed of. Yes, but I mean, but I keep hearing that for, his problem is that if he's in a movie that he's not directing, he's not that good. Well, you know what? That's too that's too dang bad. Cause that that sounds like like he's three. You know, it's like if I'm not in control, I'm not gonna do good. How did he get to where he is? Well, I, I think like that. He wrote Good Will Hunting. That's that's that's, that's a claim to fame. It won an Academy Award. Nah, it probably wasn't that good. 
It, I don't know. I've never seen it. I, I have no I, interest I've in the movie. I've seen it. I don't remember it. I have no interest in the movie. I mean, a lot of a lot of not great movies won the Academy Award. So that's not really... Like, Dances with Wolves won the Academy Award. It's like four hours long Some people it's get, a Western. Sometimes they get an award because they think it's your turn. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Boy, this is Ben Affleck sucks. I will not be happy with him as Batman. Which, because I said that, we'll make now, him like an awesome Batman. We'll be really happy with him as Batman. And I'll put this clip in that video when we're like, that was an awesome movie. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I, I reserve judgment. Like no 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 the the, the day that the did day you, that he did was you announced. See the ears? Did you see the ears on the on the bat suit? That's the suit. It has nothing to do with how no, he acts. No no no. That's part. It all it all. It all okay. snowballs into one but, but, performance. But the Adam West ears don't work for me. All right, just I'm saying. Here's look. the thing. He's directing this movie, right? Adam what? West? No, no no. Ben Affleck. No no. I, I thought he was like they, no. They, man they, of Steel, they, the Man of Steel director is directing. I thought, they, I thought, I thought they said they, they they were bringing him in to like help out and, and no, he on made, his team in or something. Nah, he was he was possibly going to do Justice League, but Zack Snyder's been so he has too. He has, so he has no zero directing power here. in anything, right? Yeah, he's just acting. He's just acting. So he's gonna suck then. No, you can't. He's gonna be. He's Batman. No, no, he's not. No, we. Batman is Batman. <laughs> he, look, he's got the best Batman suit ever. No, really, it's the Michael Keaton suit. But um, okay, I can't argue. Look, here, look and, the bottom and, line and, is are, we are don't know. Fight? Are they? Are, is, he, is he gonna fight Superman? He's not fighting Superman. I mean, they can put a versus on there all they want to. This ain't a fight. It, it's like okay, fine. Uh, now I, I have a theory that their little, their little. Um, Terraforming machines probably blasted some uranium or something and created and kryptonite on Earth. And Batman so, has all of it now. And yeah, Batman found it and, and figured Luthor that probably this was So there's that. But aside from that, Batman versus Superman, especially in a world where there's no kryptonite, is not a fight. It's not. Well, on Superman doesn't know Batman exists. And Batman Which obviously Superman he's exists. going to because two hours of Superman not knowing Batman exists in a Batman. That would be Superman funny though if like Superman's doing something and like in the background you see Batman all <laughs> obviously like like just like, like just chill on a rooftop like, like hey sticking his head right? out right like hey Clark <laughs> I'm gonna kill you <laughs> you don't even know it yet but um I'm not I'm not looking forward to it. Oh, also, why is N- Green Arrow not getting any love? Because his show is doing awesome right now. Green Arrow's show is Cause, bomb. Cause is it, is isn't Flash going to get his own movie, right? No, well, the Flash is getting his own movie, but that's, that doesn't mean that the TV Flash is getting his own, is going to be... No one in their right mind is going to have a Flash TV show, which is probably going to be really popular, and then have everyone love that Flash, and then immediately, within that same year, pick a different Flash for the big screen. No one... Oh, no... Warner Bros. Um, will do it. Warner um, Bros. will do that. Smallville was on TV when the that stupid Superman movie came out, and only one of those things survived past that point. Yeah, yeah, that should have been. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, yeah, no. I, I once again, Warner Brothers, zero faith in you. Uh, I'm, I'm sure they'll. You know what? They they might pick a different Flash, and if they ever put Green Arrow in there, a different Green Arrow, just to avoid making them movie stars. Which would then make them more up money. The price, yeah. yeah. Just stop, but just lock them in the contract saying you won't up your price. See, I agree with that because, like, let's face it, Stephen Amell is like awesome as Green Arrow. I mean, he is. Now, granted, the only difference between Stephen Amell's Green Arrow and Green Arrow in the comic books is that Green Arrow in the comic books is kind of smarmy. You know, like he's a smart aleck. He 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 he's. Really, really more like Robin Stephen Hood. Amell is he's, not. No, funny. he's really not funny he at is, all. He is he not is, happy. He's he is. Sad I will kill individual. you in the face. He is mad. I at stole the world. it from you, by he the did way. Steal that, and I will kill you in the face later. <laughs> but no, it's, he's not happy, uh, and I like that. It's a more serious character. He's well, not he, anywhere near good enough to be in the league, though. Well, why? But wait, going back to the not happy thing. Mm. Why would he be happy? His dad died to save his life. He came back. His mom, he found out, was a horrible person. And then his, died. Yeah, and then <laughs> died. His little sister turned out to be completely stupid. Okay, look. You're talking about how bad everybody is, and then you drive off with the man who literally blew up the city the year before because he's the only person who hasn't lied to you. He's been lying to you for 20-something years. Mm-hmm. He's been your dad this whole time, and apparently well, well, he knew it. Well, uh, I, don't, wait, did, I don't think he knew. He knew? He knew the whole time? At the beginning of the season, remember he comes into he comes in tomorrow and he's like, "I'm here to see my about my daughter." 
He said that at the beginning of the season. To be so he's fair, always to be known. Fair, everything he's ever said as that character, I have never listened to. I have to be honest with you right now. <laughs> His character bored the crap out of me. And so when he would come on the screen, I would like go get something to drink or something. It was... I don't remember any of that. Well, e- e- evil guy basically starts off the season. Um, you remember when when like she threatened him with Rachel Ghoul? Mm-hmm. She starts. He starts off the season by saying, "Yeah, I came to check on my daughter. You know she's mine." And then Mora goes, "Yeah, about that. There's this Rachel Ghoul guy who uh, helped me with this stuff, and I think you should leave." And he left. Now she's dead, and he's got his daughter. Right. But it's like. So, so does the sister does what's her name Speedy whatever her stupid name is does she know that he's there right now no probably not but she'll find out in the middle of the next season but it's like, after she's become like some new assassin but if she's probably about it, though, be Artemis o- Oliver Oliver may have lied to you but has he ever tried to work against you He's never. He's always trying. He's always come to save you. And she didn't really give him a chance to explain. He didn't really lie to her. He right. just found and, out. Yeah, yeah. He's like, yeah, how long have you known? And like, I'm like, Oliver, say you found out two weeks ago, because you found out two weeks ago, and something like this takes a while. But see, even if he told her that, even if he told her that, you know, I was trying to figure out a way to tell you, she'd be like, you should have told me immediately. No, because if I did that, then you'd be like, why did you tell me? I, I, I she should die. I want her to die. <laughs> Thea, oh, there we go. Thea, yeah, Thea. Thea yeah. needs to die because she's useless, and I hate her. And I hate Laurel. They both need to die. They're useless. Laurel can't die, and especially now the good Black Canary has has said he's yours. He needs you. She's leaving. He's gonna get her as Black Canary is gonna be. It's- Thea, this whole show is a giant episode of Mari, dude. <laughs> this whole thing. Okay, now now, side note. Side note from the side note from the side note because this is off topic. That's what we do. Okay, so. He's been... He leaves and Laurel is pissed off at him for killing his sister, well, her sister, while he's sleeping around. Now, he's pretty much slept with everybody, including Laurel, on this show. While he's in bed. And everyone's cool now because he's a better person. And I think half the people he slept with are dead now? No. Sister's still alive. Laurel's still alive. Well, okay, uh, the evil chick is dead. The evil chick is dead. Um, uh, who, who else has he slept with? I think, I think, oh, that's it. Since, since, he's been, he, since he's been back. Yeah, but it, but it's still a nice little tight little he circle. He really wanted to probably get with uh, Felicity. Yeah, yeah. I think he probably actually meant that whole love you thing that he said. But, you know, whatever. Yeah. She's the one girl in his life that doesn't always do stupid crap. Yeah, what is that that lady um, in James Bond movies, Money Penny? Uh-huh. Yeah, she's Money Penny. Like the one person who, if he was ever going to go straight, uh-huh. that would be who he'd be with. But he can't. But he can't do it. So yeah, that's her. Oh, uh-huh. she's Money Penny. Yeah, no, forget that. that that's stupid. I don't. I don't. I don't, I don't like <laughs> that. It's like I like you. You like me. I can kill people. Let's do this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. See how well this worked out for him in the past. It well, because he's stupid. I mean, you know. Like, like he got one woman killed and then sent an assassin after him. Now, granted, that's not really his fault because that shadow me off too. Because that was a bro code violation. Well, first off. yeah, there's that as well. But then, like Slade acts like in the situation, which I, I mean, I, even the way actually it was explained to him, what makes you think Oliver had any choice to begin with? He was tied up. Dude had a gun. Well, actually, when when Oliver explained to him, remember Slade actually said to him. I don't care. Yeah. Like, like when and the said, dumb thing was, Oliver just, just didn't kill dude right away. He just killed him immediately. He tried. No, no. He sat there and let the dude monologue. <laughs> and then, and then, and then, if you're Slade and you've been chilling with this dude for like five years or how long at that point it's been, like two years. It's like so. Here's the here's what you're gonna do. You're gonna look at me, the dude who's like basically your brother at this point. And ignore me. And what you're going to do is look at the guy who you hate because he's been trying to murder you, and listen to him as his words are like like their gospel, and then act on it to kill me. Well, actually, to be fair, the only woman who'd been on the island with them for like a year wanted him. So technically, he was probably already pissed but off. Don't you so think? He just, so he just wanted an excuse. But don't you think that the dude who hates you and is trying to kill you? would say anything to throw you off your game so that you will not kill him. Again, going back to the last episode, when Slade was talking, 
when they were talking and dude was behind bars, Slade said, it wasn't the Miracuru that made me start hating you. He said that but, to wait, him. but wouldn't it be the Miracuru to make him think that it wasn't the Miracuru that made him say that? Maybe. Yeah. That's possible. Go. But I think that the truth of the matter is that, like, he got a little jealous. I, I was thinking another word there. But he got a little jealous because, you know, the only woman on the island was messing with Oliver. And then, let's face it, she died and then another woman showed up <laughs> and he got her so too. Wait, wait, wait. So the hot Asian died and now you get the hot blonde? Uh-huh. No, what kind of world is this? I'm a military <laughs> soldier, dude. I'm special ops. Like, the only I have a beard. Alive. What is going on right now? I've got a cool accent. And he's like, but, really I'm, cool but I'm rich, though. So... There's a future with me off the island. With you, there's nothing. Yeah, just help us get off this island. Yeah, exactly. Um, <laughs> so, so, so there's he, that. He, 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 he's just mad because he ain't getting none. Pretty much, yeah. Which, 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 which let's face it, that's, that, a, that's mean, a good reason. I, I, I guess he'd be mad, but it's like, dude, trust me, when you get off this island, you're going to be such an awesome hero to your Australians. You're going to be having all the girls, so. Yeah, and you know, like, let, let's be real. I'm rich. You're going to be my bodyguard once we come off here. And you're going to be the bodyguard who's going to get paid nope. really well because you're nope. my best friend. He decided to listen to the other guy and kill, try and kill over. And now he's in Supermax. He, he'll get out. He really will. He will get out. Probably about halfway Amanda through Wall next season. let him out with the bomb. And then he'll be like, hey, watch this. As I just ripped this bomb out. And, oh, look, I can heal because I have the Miracuru. And you guys did nothing to stop No, no, that. no. They, they've healed. They've no. gotten rid of the Miracuru. It will come back. It will come back. It always comes back. There's always like a little strain that reactivates upon stress. And he'll get it back. Yeah, that's true. It, that's true. it always comes back. Like Spider-Man lost his powers. Did, did, did you know that ever happened? I assumed it did. It's comic books. Like, like, yeah, they they uh, they took his powers away when the whole Ben Riley thing happened. When he was a, when he was a, the Clone War mm-hmm. thing happened, and then one day his powers just decided to come back. Yeah, because they just, can. Because that's how it works. Now. It's just, because not, not that your DNA would, would revert to what it was originally. It reverts to the most convenient point in time. Yeah, and <laughs> well, he's a mutant. Be, you know, not, not not that the Sentinels know that or anything. Wait, so was he born a mutant? No, he's not a mutant. Right, so he... But he's a mutant. So... Look, 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 if you get bitten by a radioactive spider and become half spider, you're a mutant. No, you're a Spider-Man. There's a, there's a difference. I mean, I don't know what it is, but according to the X-Men, there's a difference. Yeah. Um, Murky point, lines, murky point lines. The point is, uh, Slade's getting out. I don't know how. Slade will get out. Now, from Slade... To Arrow, what were we talking about previously? Um, seven, <laughs> seven DC, seven movies. DC movies. Uh, so uh, uh, so far, Aquaman. Aquaman yeah, they're they're talking one. about Aquaman, Shazam, Shazam. Um, I'm gonna just. I'm gonna. Of if you're in the theater while I'm seeing the movie, I will be yelling Shazam, and you will accept it because that's happening. Pretty much. Let's face it. Any real nerd, and there's going to be real nerds that are going to be there, because this is Shazam we're talking No about. one knows who it so, is. Yeah. So, any real nerd who's watching this movie, the first time he gets his magic word, Shazam! the entire theater is going to say it. At the same time. Yeah. And then hopefully lightning will strike one of us. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, so Shazam's getting a movie. Uh, the fish guy is getting a movie. Aquaman. Um, yeah, the fish guy. And then uh, Batman and Superman are getting the movie. Yeah, Justice and League. And then Bat- Superman's getting Superman Man of Steel 2. Uh, Wonder Woman. going to be afterward. One. Wonder Woman's going to get a movie. They, yeah, they, finally, they finally they've decided, decided that Wonder like, Woman. If Thor can do it, really, at this point, even. I mean, Rocket Raccoon's going to be in a movie, dude. Yeah. Groot yeah. isn't a movie. There's. <laughs> and then, then uh, The Flash and Green Lantern get their team up movie. Um, so Howard the Duck had a movie already, right? Yeah, in the 80s. Howard the Duck got a movie before Wonder Woman. I want you all to know this. Yeah, but Wonder Woman had a TV show, though. No one does. Three no one, years. No one, no one cares about that. Linda Carter was hot. Yeah, but talking I'm talking about movies right now. I'm talking about movies. I'm talking about real super. Linda Carter was... Linda Carter's still hot. Linda Carter's like 65 years old, dude, and dude, hot as hell. Dude, she, she's all right. But if she takes offense to that, she's welcome to come on the show and defend her title as being hot. <laughs> this is not obvious celebrity bait, but you know, she's hot. Go ahead and take that bait. <laughs> um, but yeah, so uh, is Cyborg getting a movie? Uh, no, you, or he'll you, be part of the. He's movie. black. He's not getting his own movie. Look, black people who get their own movies are Blade and everybody who they know, who people know. 
Yeah. Like, Black Panther can get his own movie now because he was such a big part of the Avengers TV show. Right. For two Lightning, years. Yeah. And so now he can have Where is he now, though? He's not in Avengers. I don't know. Like, I guess he went back home. I wonder I wonder, I wonder if they kept him out to see if, uh, if people will miss him. Well, I think, the according to what I read, they said they took him out basically because they re- the Avengers roster they wanted for the TV show was the same one from the movies. But people liked Black Panther. He was like... Black Panther's awesome. He's like, he's Black Batman. Yeah, he, he, or, or at least better Tony Stark. Way better Tony Stark. Way, yeah, way, way better. better Tony way Stark. Way better Tony Stark. Like, right. his, the, his, like his introduction to the he show was, I'm going to hack everything Tony and then Stark he did. has and, and then hang like, out. He's like, how'd you get here? I studied your systems inside and out. What? How'd you know how to do that? I looked at everything you had. Come on, dude. <laughs> but he can't get married, though, because Storm's in another property. I mean, in another movie. I That's mean, true. with Fox. <laughs> <sighs> That's true. Yeah, but Fox is keeping true love apart. Well, but see, but see, no, they could call her Aurora. I'm pretty sure Fox decided to get Aurora as Storm. No, no, no. They no, that's Aurora. Oh, they okay. could call her Aurora and still be a black lady with with white hair, and they just have to get over it. Well, I mean, if they can get Scott, or or just make her inhuman. Yeah, make or it. or yeah, exactly. You can just change what she they, is. They can just make an entirely new character. Also called Storm because you can't own the word Storm. Uh huh. Marvel, do it. You know what? Do that for all the X Men. A Wolverine is an animal. You can't trademark a Wolverine. Yeah, but nobody's going to accept anybody other than Hugh Jackman playing him. Though. You can hire Hugh Jackman. Disney has more money than God. <laughs> now, they, I don't know because I, I, I've seen Rome. Not not <laughs> close. Right. No, but but no, <laughs> D- Disney has more money than Fox. That's true. They can they can pay him. Enough to do it, but they're not gonna. Because because think about it, if you're an actor and you have to choose between Fox or the Mouse. Who are you going with every time? Well, let's let's be real. One of the things that um that that Hugh Jackman has had a problem with with Wolverine is that the stories aren't really that great. They're these X Men movies. These the I think he had a chance to go to Marvel. He'd do it, and especially as Wolverine. Oh yeah, he'd go. Yeah, yeah. yeah. To be to get a chance to be Wolverine in the Age of Ultron. Come on. Seriously? Because, I mean, like, Wolverine actually was the most important character in the Age of Ultron comic books that just passed. Oh, yeah, because the cause he broke time? Yeah. Spoiler alert. You mean, like, like this movie he just did? Uh, no, he alert. no he fixed time this time. Well, he did both. He kind of did know, both. No, it shouldn't have been him. Like, like, granted, they used other mutants. To Where was Juggernaut him? through the whole movie? He's like... He lost his powers. No, this is back yeah. in time. Remember, Leech took his powers away. No, and then that was in the present. I'm talking about when they went back in time. And, fir- and first of all, first of all, you already know Leech shouldn't have <laughs> That's We've gone on that several yeah, times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. The, the He's Ruby, not a mutant. The, Ru- the Ruby of Cedarac should not have lost its powers. No, he Leech should have murdered it. Leech <laughs> and Shadowcat. But but Shadowcat needed to live so that she could send she Wolverine back in time. She just used him as a shield, and the moment he gets killed, then phase through. <laughs> But that, uh, that that's a whole other set of issues that I have. But no, he should have been in the movie because he was like the most popular character. The Juggernaut? Yeah, he was hilarious. There, there, no, no, every, no, everyone liked that one line. Because it was based off the, uh, the the YouTube series from My Way Entertainment. They were doing a long running on the Juggernaut set of videos that were hilarious. In which which now has been taken over by I'm Batman. No, 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 it's, it's still there. No, no, but I'm Batman is better though. Cause it's Batman. But you're not, have you seen the Juggernaut videos though? No. Cause Batman's better. I don't. You've I don't never seen. You never seen Juggernaut videos. Of course not. I've seen one Juggernaut video. It's that one where he's like, "Oh, the Juggernaut," and then he starts running and he bangs his head. Oh no, 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 no! You gotta no, no. They dubbed over like the old. I think it was like the '80s or the '90s cartoons, like the old ones. Uh-huh. They dubbed these, these black guys dubbed over. Dude, okay. He's gonna see the videos after this, and then we're gonna get back to you next week on that. But. Um, yeah, so DC has finally decided to catch up. Um, now, remember, they've only announced it, which means they, they still have time to be Warner Brothers and <laughs> fail at getting movies out. They've only got like another month, though, because... No, no, gonna... no, no. They, they, I believe that they would film the movies, have it done, do the promotion for it, and be like, you know what? No. No, we're going to just pull it. We're going to actually delete the, the footage so that no one can ever see this. No, nah, they, they wouldn't do that. Marvel did that. Marvel shot a movie in Candid? Fantastic Four. That first one. No, Fox did that. Yeah, yeah. It's still a Marvel movie. Yeah, but they did it. It came out. No, it didn't. 
They made, they filmed that movie specifically so they would keep the rights. Then they filmed the one with Captain America as Johnny Storm. Wait, there was another one before the Yeah, first there one? was another one. No that like like it's only been seen at like comic conventions. Like four people have seen was it. Was it worse? Oh, you haven't seen Okay. We have this green screen back here. Okay, I'm going to show you this picture. I want you to put it up there. You're assuming I can find it. Oh no, it's it's easy to find. Okay. Okay, it's that picture right there. Okay, I don't, now, I don't know what the picture is, though, so why, why don't you say it out loud so that I can look at the recording later and figure out what it is. <laughs> I just did. It's that picture right there. Oh, okay, so I'm just going to find... You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get a black screen and have it say that picture, and then that's what <laughs> you're going to see. I can pull it up on my phone. Okay, well, just... Why don't, why don't you say it? Like, the, the thing what, is, what, 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 what are we seeing right now? Um, well, it's, like, really, really cheesy Fantastic Four uniforms. They're the light blue with the white collars, and the thing's got, like, no lips. He looks... I don't know, like a... Like a turd, really. <laughs> but, but aside from that, it was really cheesy. They, they, um, I've seen a little bit of footage from this whole thing, um, and they basically use camera effects to make the effects. So it's like when Mister Fantastic was stretching, they took a rubber band and they stretched it, and then they moved the camera so that it looked like his arm was stretching. Yeah, it was really bad. No. Yeah, no. it's re it's really bad. Sue Wait, Storm was it filmed on a home video camera? It might have been. I don't In know. A weekend by, the, <laughs> by by someone's kids, so they don't lose the right. Sue Storm to turn invisible. Like you know how like they will they will say I'm gonna turn invisible, and then they would turn the camera off, no. and then she would leave the screen. No, <laughs> no, they didn't. No, you didn't. Fox, no. I believed. Go Look. Galact Cloud <laughs> took more effort. I, I were, no, sir. Oh, I say the nay. I no like one said that said. is third grade. That is third grade. And <laughs> oh wait, wait, wait. So did they pretend that she was doing stuff? Yeah. No. I look, I've only seen five minutes of footage. So you know the 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 um whatever it was that was floating across the screen. I forget with I think by hold being held by a string and that was her. No, oh yeah, no, that was terrible. I oh, yeah. do not believe that it exists. That does not it exist exists. because there is a god in this world. There's there's <laughs> a, there's a 1980s Justice League TV show that also exists. Live action? Oh yeah, it's horrible. Is it worse than the Captain America throwing a plastic shield? Oh yeah. It's way worse than that, dude. We should we should do a, uh, a uh, worse contest. Um, the Fantastic the, uh, Four will, will win. Oh, oh, oh! It's bad. It's, it, it, it is worse bad. than 1980s attempts. Yeah, it's bad. Mm. <laughs> oh man! Okay like, then. Uh, if any of you have actually seen the the uh, Fantastic Four movie that I'm talking about here, somebody tell somebody. I I, I want to hear what you have to say about it. Tell us. No, matter no. of fact, I would I would like to see a YouTube uh, video well, on don't. somebody who's seen please that. Please don't do it. It's terrible. I, oh my it, god, it sounds awful. It sounds awful. It's like like if anyone aside from me has seen that Wonder Woman TV show that that first that first episode, just in, in, just leave us a little message. Tell us how terrible you thought it was. I thought it was horrid. Well, I mean the new the newer one or yeah the newer one from from, from like, pants? like three thousand like from like three years ago <laughs> three, from three, three thousand, thousand years ago from where, like, where from are you from <laughs> sir uh, I I am Booster Gold <laughs> except for I'm you know not white don't have blonde hair not wearing gold and you don't and sound have no powers you don't sound annoying oh wait never mind I'm not Booster Gold at all okay anyway, <laughs> so but, um oh uh, while we're talking about things you should be doing um if you liked Celebrity Battle Dome let us know who you want to see. I'm gonna go go ahead and open it up to voice actors as well, um, which means Ugh. people who've done anime um, are gonna be incredibly powerful. Like Steve Bloom might be God. Uh, but yeah, so that's it for this week. Um, until next time, we've been your host Kirby Kid and Black Superman. See you later, guys. Hey guys, don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, and share our videos like crazy. That's right, because we love you, we want you to love us, and we want to keep making videos for you. And keep leaving us comments. We love comments. Yes, and we answer comments. Unlike some of the other guys, we'll get out there, we'll answer them, and if you uh, have a great comment, we'll make a video about it. And if you have a not-so-great comment, we will try to address that issue. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, thanks. Till next time, we've been your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys. Yeah, oh, by the way, hmm. the fourth can't beat Thor. He can. He cannot. Yes, he can. He cannot. Yes, he can. He cannot. He totally can. Oh, Naruto can fly. <laughs> <laughs> With some bullcrap. <laughs>